What is good y'all? So I have another tutorial for you guys and this tutorial will be about how to add multiple characters in your roster that have the same file name. So for instance, let's say I have Goku in my roster and I found another updated Goku that I want to add to the roster but they both have the same name and it won't let me put both of them together. So I'm going to show you how to put two characters together in the same roster with the same name. So let's do it. So for here, for this instance, we have Golden Cell. So I have Golden Cell. I downloaded him right here. Golden Cell, here's the file. So we got two Golden Cells though. One Golden Cell I have in the roster, and the other one I want to add to the roster, but I don't want to replace the older Golden Cell. So let's go to my characters, my character folder in Mugen here. So this is the character folder, and as you see, we have golden cell right here so I have this other golden cell that I want to try out but as you could see they have the same exact name so if I were to try to just drop them in here it will say this right here they have a destination with the same file names blah 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 replace the files and you don't want to do that because then you're deleting one of the golden cells or you're gonna corrupt the files because you're mixing up two different files so here's what you gotta do simple solution so you're just gonna go right click golden cell here and then rename the new one the new golden cell you're gonna add to the game just rename it to like anything golden cell 2 that works okay so now since the names changed we can just drop them in here golden cell 2 and now we have golden cell and golden cell too. So simple as that. Now the last step is go to the data folder, select.def, where we can add in the character name. All right, so we have golden cell here. So under that, let's just put golden cell two slash golden cell. So that's how you gotta do it. So we're redirecting this golden cell 2 folder. We're making Mugen read golden cell 2 folder, but inside the golden cell 2 folder is the golden cell. So that's how the Mugen here, the select.def has to read it. It has to go into the golden cell 2 folder and look for the golden cell.def. So save it. And if you have like three of them, let's say you have a third golden cell, all you gotta do is do golden cell three slash golden cell. If you have a hundred of them, golden cell 100 forward slash golden cell. As long as you have the slash golden cell, it doesn't matter what this is called. All right, so now we saved it. All right, so let's close this one and restart it so we can have our changes made. And let's see if everything is legit. And there we go. Okay, so let's open it up, go to watch. And there you see we got both golden cells here. Two different golden cells. Same name in the same game. Alright, so this is like not that big of a problem, but I, I when at certain points I had to figure this situation out. So maybe some of you guys have the same situation that you were trying to like figure out so that's how you do it so here we go just to make sure they're both fightable and there we got it both cells on the screen same time there you have it so if you guys enjoyed this video or it helped you out just drop that like subscribe if you're not and I'll be dropping some more tutorials for you guys in the future. Take care. Peace out.